practicing the change of base formula for logs. Okay, let's practice a basic logarithm problem. Log base seven of 49. This is a simple problem if you understand what logs really mean. Seven is the base. 49 is the number or the answer. The log problem is looking for the exponent. What exponent makes a seven into a 49? We have the seven, we have the 49. What we don't have is the exponent. So seven to what exponent is 49? And the answer is two. Okay, log base five of 25. Five to what exponent gives you 25? Log base five of 25. Five is the base, 25 is the number. I am looking for the exponent. So five to what power is 25? Two. Three to what power is 27? Three. Two to what power is 64? Well, I don't know. So I'm gonna have to make a factor tree. So take 64, break it down, and I break it down all the way to its product of primes. And I can see that I need to multiply two to the sixth to get 64. So log base two of 64. I have the base, I have the number, and I'm looking for the exponent. How many twos does it take to multiply to get 64? Six. Now, what's the change of base formula? This is the change of base formula. If we were to write this in everyday language, we would say that this is log of the number divided by log of the base. Or you can also think of log of the answer divided by log of the base. So let's practice this. I know that log base five is 25, but with your calculator, I want you to take log of 25, divide it by five. Now, how come this log problem does not have a little subscript as a base? That's because if you don't see a base, we're assuming it's base 10. And your calculator, when you hit the log button, it does all your logs base 10. So we need to use the change of base formula to convert log base five into log base 10 so we can use the calculator. So with your calculator, take log of 25, which is log base 10 of 25, divide it by log base 10 of five, and you may need to use parentheses. So you really need to practice doing this with your calculator. Some calculators need parentheses in different places. So log base 10 of 25 divided by log base 10 of five is two. And we saw in the video, you could also use natural log, but I use log base 10. So convert this using the change of base formula. Log of the number divided by log of the base. Log base 10 of the number divided by log base 10 of the base. Plug that into your calculator and see if you get three as an answer. If you don't get three as an answer, you're typing it in wrong. Log base two of 64 is log base 10 of 64 divided by log base 10 of two log of the number divided by log of the base, or log of the answer divided by log of the base. If you plug that into your calculator, you should get six. So the change of base formula can be very handy for calculating these logs so that we can plug them into a regular scientific calculator.